Hey y'all, this your girl Jazzy, aka JC Cutie, coming at you guys with a um what is this? With a tag video, yeah. Um I was watching the Toya Baby Fat, aka Miss Barbie's video, um, her Valentine's Day tag, and I was like, oh, I wanna do it. So I'm going I'm doing that tag now. Excuse me if I you see me keep looking like upward. I have on lashes and they're a little they're long behind my glasses so they keep getting caught on my glasses so I keep going like that so that way they won't get stuck on my glasses and I hate wearing my glasses like keep right here like a grandma so yeah um I would use a hair on my lip and it's driving me insane but it won't come off okay I think I finally got it off anywho so yeah um, like I said I'm gonna be doing the Valentine's Day tag and so yeah Question number one is which, uh, which is your favorite Valentine's Day treat? Sweet tart, sweethearts, yeah, or chocolate covered strawberries? Out of those two, I would have to say chocolate covered strawberries. But my favorite Valentine's Day um treat are um turtles. Yeah, my favorite Valentine's Day treat is turtles. I love chocolate covered turtles. They're so delicious. Um, the original, the ones with the uh pecans in them or pecans, whatever you want to call them. Um, so yeah, turtles are my favorite, but out of those two, I'd have to go with chocolate covered strawberries. Question number two is, what is your favorite Valentine's Day memory? I have a lot. Um, when I was little, pretty much all my Valentine's when I was, when I was little, um, because I'd usually spend the night over my auntie's house on Valentine's Day, and when we'd wake up in the morning, we'd have big old baskets full of candy and goodies, and for me, I had like the little nails like not the press on nails but like the plastic nails that you like slip over your finger like those type of nails and like the play high heel shoes and the play pearls and the play earrings and the play rings and all things girly um and all those other good stuff lots and lots of chocolate i love chocolate and not the not the nasty cheap chocolate no like snickers and um hershey kisses and turtles and I've loved turtles since I was a baby, since I was little, like, for real. Um, just all those type of things from when I was little. And then my favorite Valentine memory from when I'm older would have had to have been last Valentine's Day, which was my first Valentine with my boo and with my boyfriend. And we had so much fun. We went to church because it was on a Sunday. So we went to church, and then after church, um, we went to his house, and he cooked for me. I think we had, I think he made like a pot roast or something like that and green beans and greens. Greens for him, green beans for me. I don't eat greens. Um, we had rice. He made cornbread just the way I like it. He hates cornbread that tastes like cake. But since that's the only way I'll eat cornbread, he made me some jiffy with some extra, extra, extra sugar. It was delicious. And so, yeah. And we just hung out and we chilled. Um, we went to, um, a, his church had a, um, valentine's day party type situation so we went to that and that was fun and yeah we chilled did some things and had fun so yeah so since i've been since i'm older that was my favorite memory but all my um childhood valentine's that i spent in my auntie's house those were always good um next question is twilight or harry potter valentine's neither i'm not into twilight nor harry potter so yeah neither one um, question number four is what celeb would you not mind having as your Valentine? Um, of course, like uh, Latoria said, Trey Song, who's fine still. Trey Song, so doggone fine. I would not mind spending Valentine's Day with him. Um, who else? I wouldn't mind spending Valentine's Day with LL Cool J with his little old enough to be my daddy self. Yep. Him. Who else? Under 3,000. I love me some under 3000 This last one, y'all probably going to be like, for real, Jasmine, like, for real. But, seriously, I have, like, the biggest crush on Rick Ross. Don't ask me why, but I just have, like, the hugest crush on Rick Ross. And whenever my friends hear that I have a crush on Rick Ross, they, they're just like, why? I mean, ugh. But I don't know. It's just something about him. He's like a, I don't know. But I have a big crush on um, Rick Ross. So, Rick Ross can definitely get it, too. Um, 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 question number five. Do you have anyone special to celebrate Valentine's Day with? Yes, I have my boyfriend. Unless he must have done between now and the 14th. Um, <laughs> I'll spend it with him. But I very seriously doubt he'll, he's going to do anything retarded in between now and the 14th. So, I mean, we've been together for a minute. So, yeah. 
Question number six is which restaurant would you prefer a Valentine's date? Cheesecake Factory or Ruby Tuesdays? Um, I'd have to say Cheesecake Factory. Even though Ruby Tuesdays is my favorite, like, family-style restaurant. And when I say family-style, I mean, like, Applebee's, Chili's, um, Benigan's, Oh Charlie's, restaurants like that. Ruby Tuesdays is my favorite. Um, but I want that for my birthday because it's my favorite. So, I'd go Cheesecake Factory for Valentine's Day. Mm -hmm. Question number seven is pink or red lips on Valentine's Day. Uh, hello, pink lips. Y'all know I have an obsession with pink lips right now. So, definitely, definitely, definitely pink lips. But probably Valentine's Day I won't have on any lips because, um, I don't because my boyfriend a lot. So, and that's just kind of, I don't want to taste it and he don't like the taste of lip gloss and lipstick. So, yeah. Question number eight is dress or a cute top to wear on Valentine's Day. Um, I'm kind of torn right now, actually. Uh, and I might actually have to have you guys help me decide what to wear. One outfit, I have to go buy a blazer and some shoes. And then the other outfit, I have pretty much everything for it. So, yeah. But um, after watching the C.R. Ray's video on her three Valentine's Day outfit tag, um, she had on... Um, she had turned a dress into a skirt and I was like oh my gosh I could so totally do that so what I was thinking about doing was taking is wearing one of my bubble hems dresses in as a skirt because you can fold it I can fold the top part into the dress or whatever and then wearing a lace tank and a black um, blazer and some cute black pumps but the only thing is that skirt I mean the dress is kind of very short so yeah but I mean it's really cute but it's gonna be cold so I don't know we'll have to wait and see um so either way the dress is gonna end up being a skirt so I'd be wearing a cute top so a cute top and a skirt or some pants I haven't decided yet um question number nine is perfect okay the perfect perfect date would it be dinner in a movie or dinner in a walk on the beach? Dinner in a movie. It's too cold to be walking on the doggone beach. Uh uh. And I don't. Mm, sand in between my toes? No, ma'am. No, sir. No. So, dinner in a movie. Mm -hmm. Um, And the last question is hair up or hair down for a Valentine's Day date? My hair is actually going to be up this year because by the time Valentine's Day comes around, my hair, because it's straightened right now, is not going to be looking its best. So, I'll probably end up doing an updo of some sort. So, yeah. That is my Valentine's Day tag. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Bye, y'all.